sure this would probably be better in the actual movie Hiroshi. where I actually got time to care Hiroshi. about these characters, but it's been like 20 fucking minutes. Hiroshi. It's a trick. It's a trap! Follow me, I'm not being creepy. <laughs> Surprise, you dumbass kid. Hiroshi. Man, if only we could just enlist Jay's help, he could just bring that entire building down. Oh, Doras is here too. I'm sorry, he has rocket punches now? Yeah, I got it. Is that it? I'm sorry, is that... Shin, is that you? Have you come to help me? I don't actually know when Shin came out. Let's look that up. Sorry, did that grasshopper cricket just tell him where to go? I don't know if actually pressing the buttons made me skip over the rest of that, uh... The rest of that or not. Wow, that's some, uh... That's some Ichigo level transformation there. Although I guess it's better than the eye-popping gore that is Shin's transformation. But yeah, I don't know if I skipped over part of it, for it was literally just, I got rocket punched and that was it. I don't know, maybe how long how long the health bar is determines how long the scene is. I don't actually know. I guess we'll find out. I'm not going to press anything this time, but judging by how low this health bar is, maybe it should only take, like, one thing. Maybe. Hiroshi. Rider. How do you know my name? Oh, God! Fuck you! That thing is definitely dead. Okay, maybe maybe it does determine how long they go for. I don't know. It's just like, no! Fist! Still sad there has been no declaration of a rider punch or a rider kick yet. Hiroshi! Wake up! Ryder! Ryder! Wow! Rider. Is that his dad? Doctor... Doctor Mochizuki? Father? Hiroshi... Father! Wow, you look like shit! No, no, run away! No, no, this is me acting. Sorry, what? What the fuck am I looking at? Hiroshi go, and I'll do whatever you want. I won't allow you to hurt either of them. What? I can't understand what the fuck the monster is saying.
Like, legit, can anyone else make out what she was saying? I sure as fuck couldn't. Alright, looks. I'm guessing we're at the showdown then. Because this looks like prime, uh, prime, like, final battle confrontation bullshit with, uh, Doros. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I think, uh, so far the greatest thing about this is it's made me want to actually watch the movie. It's super cheap. This is super cheese as hell, but, I mean, this is also show level era, so I'd expect nothing less. Aw. Uh. Okay, Zo, you've got this. Or maybe you don't. I can't actually tell. What is with this camera movement? I'll keep hitting B until I get one of these right. Also, man, this bit crunched fucking footage is giving the frame is uh doing the frame right no favors. Oh wow, he knocked me so hard, he knocked me out of transformation. Hey, you succeeded by getting your ass kicked. Way to go! Oh great, it has tentacles too? Fantastic. Hiroshi, distract him. Get his attention away from Ryder. Uh, well, seeing as how he said distract him, uh... Because somehow Hiroshi is going to save the day at the end of this. I just fucking know it. Also because I could apparently tank that. Let me guess. There's ten chapters to this. Well, I'll allow it. They at least kept the henshin in. Is that actually Zio's theme? Oh, the one time they don't press C. Uh... Kick? Oh, that was wrong. Ouch. Oh, that is a problem. Uh, so yeah, rescue Hiroshi. Pardon me for just a moment. Quick load is F8. F8, okay, that's why. That's why I got it wrong, okay. Keep that in mind. There we go. Ah, the wonders of using uh, emulators, because I'm sure this would cost a thousand fucking dollars to own, and it would not be worth it. Shin. Yeah, you won. 
So yeah, I guess it is dependent on just how many are there. All right, Zo Punch. It's kind of really stupid that you can just fail by guessing wrong. That's really dumb. But I guess that's the point of all these uh, fucking uh, uh, like FMV games. It's all about memorization, how far you can get. I'm sorry, did he just absorb Zoe? Oh god, now he really does look like Shin's bastard brother. Either that or he looks like a very prototype uh, red shadow moon. What the fuck did it say? I'm not getting this one right. Uh... Help? <laughs> fuck you. I can't even understand the thing to know what my clue was. Refusing? Fuck you. Uh, struggle? The fuck's the. Oh. of Doras. Man, all these buttons and no A's, really? At least the music sounds nice, I'll give it that much credit. The video is compressed out all hell and back, but at least the audio sounds nice. I mean, aside from the fucking monster's voice. Rider kick. And I guess we just have the conclusion now. I'm actually really curious to watch this now, because I feel like, uh, I know I'm technically missing a shit ton of context, but I'm actually really curious. That piece of board just stayed with him. And that's it. Did you get the ending, I guess? Yes, Hiro. 
Archie. I'm finished here. You're safe. And At I least until the on. numerous Showa vs. Heisei movies come out. Then I will be back. Hiroshi! Sort of. Grandpa! Are you alright? Yes, Grandpa. I still want to know where he got his clothes from. Did he just, like, Terminator that shit? Just find a bar and steal it off someone? Remember your father. I will. Good. Remember, don't make evil science experiments in the bottom of your house. <laughs> no promises! Close enough. Brother! He just turns into a monster. Yeah, that's about how I figured that was going to end. You going to actually roll credits, or do I have to actually watch him drive across the uh, street? I guess the answer is the latter. I wonder if the game has any credits. Oh, there we go. I like that that's probably all their Japanese voice actors, not not the actual people who played the, who played them here. Or maybe those are the actual actors and not their voiceovers. I don't know. Anyways, that was The Masked Rider, Common Rider, Zoe. As an FMV game, it was all right. I mean, personally... I've always been interested by the genre that is the FMV genre, but I've always never been good at it because it's one of those things where it's... I've never really liked games that just use memorization as its only gameplay, and that's really all you've got here. You get some decent visuals uh, to go along with it and some pretty good music to go along with it, but ultimately you're just watching a glorified movie while doing quick time events. So I don't really know how to feel about the genre as a whole, so I won't hold that necessarily against uh, Zoe. What I will hold against it is the fact that it's... The video is very bit crunched to hell and back. That's no surprise. The Sega CD wasn't exactly a powerhouse. Really weird thing to bring to the West, though. Ah. Uh, this time the West had no idea what the fuck Common Rider was, so and this would be a year before Saban would unveil uh <laughs> replay movie part? Uh no. Uh this would be a year before uh Saban would make uh Saban would make uh <sighs> before Saban would make Mass Rider, so yeah. I don't really know. The best thing I can say about this is that the uh, sound was nice. I'm glad they didn't try to, like, pump in their own shitty sound effects. The English dub is a low-budget English dub, but that's to be expected. It's a Sega CD game. Were you expecting a masterpiece? Overall, this game is... It's okay. Just... Okay, if you like the FMV genre, you might enjoy this more. If you don't, however, there's no reason to watch to play this. Just watch, watch me watch it. That's pretty much what it was. This was not a let's play. This was a let's watch. And I hope I don't. Well, considering how bit crushed it was, I don't think I'll get copyright claimed for this. Maybe for the audio. Anyways, that's gonna be it for now, guys. So until next time. I'll catch you all later. We have plenty more to look at for Common Rider Month.
Asta.